Hello, class here, transistor. Okay. Road to high rise. We're like, right the we're, we're doing the plus still. It hasn't changed. Oh, we've got snapshots. Uncertainty generators. I don't check packets anymore, so I can just be, feel free to play like I want to. Taking snapshots. How about this? And that is, I can put the load in front of me and then just bounce. Uh, why am I standing next to me? So I can take damage. Everybody loves taking damage. That's why we turn so many limiters on, so I can take more damage. Whoa! Something hurt significantly. I didn't like it. Because I was lying about the taking damage thing. Maybe they thought I was serious. Maybe they're just trying to help. I don't even know what's going on in this battle anymore. There, there are cells everywhere. I'm breaking stuff. Weeds are spawning. Maybe from some of the cells. I'm exploding things and it's drawing in enemies. Alright, load's lost. That wasn't even like a good load though. I mean like... Oh yeah, the purge doesn't stack, so I might as well just crash. Um... Yeah. Oh, but do I not get the... I don't know if I get the data since my function overloaded. That was the whole point of using that combo. I don't really like that combo, though, because... I don't know. The load already kicks things away. I would rather have Void there than Cull. Void would be a higher damage amp. I don't need the knockback. I should just keep him crashed perpetually by staggering them instead of using three in a row during a turn. That would have been a better idea. Process. Still a step ahead. Now I need to wait to get Cull back I before I can this. get my data. However, that was one battle down. Oh, and here's a back door. Maybe I'll just Sounds call this like a back door episode, even though waves. that was two minutes before the back door. Same Put a waves. time link in the description. What have we got? We do not have the next agency test. Oh man, there are three performance tests left. Lucky door number four. I think I'll level up off of this test. Let's break some waves. All right. 3 of 20. Oh yeah, I do have 20 functions, don't I? Just counting the ones that are like I have to scroll to. I've been scrolling with mouse wheel, by the way. Oh. I think I just go with an upgraded spark instead of a tap. Maybe not. Maybe I should go the other way. Yeah, let's just let's just bring tap. I don't have nine limiters on. Eleven waves? We're fighting mans. Ow. Why did I not do that during a turn? Uh, the world may never know. Okay. <laughs> Alright, but we heal up. You know. Let's try this. I almost tried it once. It looked impressive, but I think I needed to... Whoa. I think I needed to put tap somewhere else because um I needed some data or something. I think I'm gonna run away from the haircut explosion. Nope. Haircut gets stuck on a wall. Thanks. Oh. Oh, you just lose. Oh yeah, because that was my only function. <laughs> For a second I was thinking you just lost if you ran out of hit points. But no, that's not quite true. It's just that I only had one function, so that was my last function. Oh! You can't, like, combo them while they're in the air. 
So what I should do is backstab. I don't know why I unpaused there. I could have probably actually dodged. I don't know. What have we got? For some reason, I'm still going with the one function strategy. Because I'm bad. Right, and uh, you still can't hit them while they're up in the air. Right, I think this will... No, it won't kill. It doesn't... Oh, it totally did. Why, why was the damage estimate off? Who knows. Oh, maybe because it actually was a backstab. He might have been barely rotating. Alright, we cleared it! With our hit points. Ooh, bounce. I bet bounces that knock back enemies would be good. Maybe this is what we upgrade with Cull. And Spark. Just have one upgraded function again. Yeah, because you just want everybody away from you, don't you? Ooh, I explode your explosions. That is a lot of knocking things around. So silly. But I mean, they can't attack me pretty much. Ow! Just kidding. They, they can attack me plenty well. I just... I, I need to be careful. But I mean... Oh! Emergency turn, that's fine. Oh, but he's stealthed, isn't he? Oops. That's not undo. Um, as long as I knock the haircuts away from myself and not up against the wall, um, they're like not gonna hit me. I just need to be careful about where I'm standing so that I don't like get hit on the rebound. Wow, he unstealthed at a poor time for himself. I was just like idly shooting at him. All right. Um, now that we have Crash, I think I want Cull to be the main. We pull him in, we cull him, and it'll also steal life? I have that much memory. Wow, is this whole thing about mans? Oh wait, I have no good function for dealing with haircuts. I might lose now. Oh, but they explode where they were if I get them. They don't explode after being pulled to me. Okay, things are significantly better than I thought they were. No, I don't want another coal there. Or do I? If it would hit the haircut, I would like it. Can, is there a position that... Hmm. Well, I can just get the haircut and... Oh, it only deals eight there. Get the haircut there and then move. Oh, but he's going to be knocked around, isn't he? But I think the coal will go off before the enemy explodes. I don't know. That was a lot of thinking for just hitting an enemy once, effectively. I think pull was a bad idea just because of the enemy types here. There are enemy types that I already have no problem walking up to during it, or before initiating my turn. Except for the haircuts, which I don't want to be next to at all. Oh, I'm blocked. Still blocked. I want to kill both haircuts on this turn, and also damage a man. Would've liked for that to be a backstab, but can't have everything. Oh! Right! Standing in haircuts.
Don't stand in the haircut. <laughs> Run away with the end of your turn. Yeah. Come on, become visible. I'm gonna run away with the end of my turn anyway. Even though, yeah, the haircut, it was spawning. Oh! That was bad. I have to kill a man with git. I even want to initiate turns. Yeah, it's even a stealth man. So you don't even get to hit him with the haircut explosions. <laughs> Alright, got him. Well, Cole, it was a bad function anyway. Oh, we don't even have it. It's, it's not overloaded. It's just gone. Uh, however, I think it is still counting against us. All right, let's get some weird, like, bounce, spark, purge. Sure. Or no. Instead of spark, let's put crash on it. So it amplifies the damage from its own damage over time. What does this do on get? Multiple projectiles with reduced damage, so it's a lot like putting spark on the thing. Um, by which I mean... Breach. Alright. Ow! <laughs> I'm, I'm really good at dealing with these haircuts. I, sh I should really just have spent turns. Is there no stealth one? Man, this phase is free. Just, you know, repeatedly crash him. <laughs> Bounce crash, too good! Oh, we get another crash. Yeah, let's resist 25% damage, I guess. I could use a more expensive function. I have five spare memory, and I'm using everything. Alright. Ah. Uh, getting stuck on walls is bad for your health if you get hit because of it. Alright. Stealth is the one I want. Ooh. That was bad. Two things spawning on me at the same time that immediately explode. Because I hit them. I mean, my fault for right clicking while not in the middle of a turn, right? Ah! Okay. I don't even know which the stealth one is. Oh, that's extremely bad. We're down to just pull again. This is why I can't spend all my memory, because I'm losing functions. I think I might have lost. Again. With all the stealth things, this is the long one. Whatever, maybe I'll get better functions next time and not lose them randomly. Like, what do I actually want? It... it regenerate too. What's making them regenerate? This just isn't gonna end. I'm just gonna lose. Nope. Abort. <sighs> All right, get, we're gonna, gonna try it again. Same time. We've seen how it can go badly. And I think I'm getting used to the traps. And all of them have the name haircuts. Let's break some waves. So I feel like Cull is not as good as I want it to be. Go oh, breach. Off we go. All right, just one man. Oh, I, I should just do this during a turn. Thanks for facing away from me. 
Reach takes a really long time while you're not. I'm gonna turn. Whatever, it's fine. Alright, what do we got? We got load. What do you do here? Max damage, 110%. Target penetration removed, but a blast radius of 200. I don't think I like that. I think I want this. Where will the packet explode? Over on him? Oh, but he turned invisible! Some kind of invisible jerk. I do need to hit this haircut and run. Man, how is this 11 waves? That's like totally unfair. Oh. Should have probably saved some stuff to move away. Oh! Man, that load packet. That was a non ideal use of load. I wish I had a turn. Oh, he's stealth again. as much damage as I can while he's existing. Oh, nice. The haircut didn't hit me that time. I think I would have lost the function if it had. Or maybe it would have just reduced me to one. It seems like they're not actually allowed to kill you. And what I could really use would be ping. If I could ping the packets... Which sounds like a legitimate networking thing to do. <laughs> but it's not! <laughs> an address. <laughs> oh, he's the shooty one, not the stealth one. I wasn't even paying attention to what I was killing. I just wanted it dead. Oh Everything. Oh, nice. Git. That's that's acceptable. Cheap way to deal with all right, all right. Uh, haircuts without spending a whole breach on them. Oh, and then if I if I could get jaunt and upgrade my get with it. All right, and then I need to move away. No, I need to kill the haircut. Oh, it's blocked. I didn't hit the packet? Why am I bad at this game? Alright, this needs dead. Uh, I can at least... No, I need to place that load better. Like, what am I doing? Just right-click on the enemy as I'm placing loads so that it gets directly on the line. But you know, uh, it, it hits fine. Oh, he's stealthy! Of course! Alright, this should be good. Oh, except it wasn't! Well, at least I still have the, uh... Load and the thing to trigger it with. Oh, except I didn't, because it was a point blank. So I need to spawn my packet, and then back away from it. Is that really out of- Oh, it's because I'm casting load. Like, is that really out of range? Blocked. Oh, I think it's blocked by the packet. Oh. Wait. No, don't cast load. The 
this is a really awkward combination of functions. <laughs> no, I need to get for more than five damage. Oh, he's invisible. Perfect. <laughs> Alright, I can bring him over to my packet that's here. Uh, let's just leave... No, let's not even cast that packet. This is, this is good enough for this turn. So I don't have to wait very long for more turn energy. Got him. But we lost the function. Alright, let's, let's put bounce on. Bounce, it's good. It's bounce flood, even. Bounce flood is fun. Ow. I need to still, like, not have that stuff explode on me. No, I think I, I don't really want to spend my turn when they could spawn haircuts. I want to be ready uh, to do a turn as soon as possible so that they don't actually like, get to me and explode on me. Oh, and then I go and spend my entire turn for some reason. Well, I'm talking about why I shouldn't spend whole turns. I do think spending half turns is going to be superior, though. So I'm glad there's no stealth one here. So if I, if I can stand back... Oh, but they're fast. Maybe I can't stand back. Oh, why did that explode? Also, did I totally mix up Spark and Flood? More to work with. Yeah, my bounces were leaving a trail. That's Flood, not Spark. Whatever, we got Crash. We'll put it on the bounce, because that's good. Oh, and that's why the haircut blew up. Because the trail. Ow. That, that was the best emergency turn ever. Uh, oh yeah, I moved during the turn. I was like, why can't I spend my turn again? Because I wanted the um, haircut to be finished spawning. Not hit the man. Man, stealth and sturdy at the same time is really annoying. So they just go invisible and then heal up. However, that was, I think, good enough damage they won't heal up all the way. No, there does seem to be a delay after you um, cancel your turn before you can turn again. Oh yeah, I guess because um, I discovered that already when... Um, I was using, uh, help on a passive and farming for the 25%. They're all healed up! Yeah, I would have never done this with only get against four of them. I can't even do it with, like, I need to be casting load or something. Oh, and then the haircut shoves the packet away. So I think I do need to spend whole turns. Or else I'm just not actually going to win. However, spending whole turns is also a good way to lose. I, I have to play it safe. If I lose my functions, it's over. No, oh, but by the time the haircut finishes spawning, they're invisible again. The stealth one's the worst thing ever. I believe is the conclusion to be drawing. Oh, and I just lost bounce. Thank you. 
Th this is over. <laughs> I I've spent 23 Same minutes on this one test. Same it's 11 time. waves long, and I can't even like beat five or something. Lucky door number four. Yeah. All right. Well, this is clearly the last Great attempt of the episode. Give me some good ones. Crash. Breach on crash for more range. Sure. Off we go. Okay, you're not even invisible. Whoa. You can get stuck on a wall or something. Or you can just blow up on me, I don't care. We got we got get again and we got ping. Ping is good. Get I might as well put it here. I mean if I'm gonna be stronger versus distant targets, then I guess it's good to also have the range increase on the same thing. Oh, the enemies weren't even like done spawning. Use ping, but I don't know. No, that wasn't even a ping. I'm bad. Yep. Now let's reset. 